this rather idyllic setting is the River Varta. Approximately three or four kilometers upstream, it's joined to the River Nair. The River Varta then goes on to flow into the River Oder, uh, quite close to Frankfurt on Oder. We can hear some frogs in the distance. I imagine it's a very beautiful place here for waterfowl as well and a uh, nice place to go rowing or something of that nature. See some people out fishing. It's early in the morning, it's a Sunday. It's now quarter past nine. Now looking directly in front of me is the place where the mill stood. I've found no remains so far but the mill where Jewish people were taken to spend the last night of their lives before going early in the morning to Helmno to be gassed. They were taken from the railway station well, say railway station, it wasn't a station there, as far as I've now been able to gather, they were taken from the railway, marched down here, locked up for the night with no facilities, and then taken in the morning to home now. Now, I, re I think the reason why they came so late was probably this. If the deportations were coming from Wuj, the deportations would normally take place in the morning, by the time the train got here, it was probably late afternoon, something like that. I mean, the trains, if they went to Kowo, may have, may have taken as long as four hours, depends on the circumstances. May have been quicker. Bear in mind that the, the route is not direct. And so it was late. What I've also been able to ascertain so far here is that the Nazis in Helmno liked a job where they worked from 9 till 5. They weren't too keen on working through the night. Unlike other places such as Auschwitz, such as Treblinka, where they did murder people during the night. The lady I was speaking to earlier told me of people coming in very elegantly dressed. I presume that these were transports coming in directly from Germany. Not if they'd been to the, the Wuj ghetto, then they certainly weren't coming here elegantly dressed. I'll try to get her to be more specific about what she meant by elegantly dressed, but uh, all she could say is how attractive the women looked, which unfortunately doesn't lead me to a great deal of information. So, the mill stood here. From both of the witnesses I've spoken to so far, pointed this out to be the site. <laughs> 